Hello and welcome back to my channel and welcome to this week's Secret Not Secret Kid Club Scrapbooking with a Twist, the series that I do with my lovely friend Karina. Karina over does it over on Instagram and of course I will have her link down below and I do it here on YouTube. And this is a series where we either use our kits or um, make a project based on a challenge issued to us by Christina or one of the challenges in the um, online scrap party, the monthly online scrap party that we have. And this one for me is a little bit of a combination because it is the scrap lift challenge but Christina challenged me specifically when she was doing the live to turn this into a December Daily, a smaller form, either a TN or a six by eight format. So we are scrap lifting. The challenge was to scrap lift my lovely friend, Vicky, Vicky Lopez Duran. Her Instagram will be linked down below as well and the layout that I am scrap lifting, which is exactly the same one that Christina scrap lifted, of course, is up here in the corner. And as you can see, I took Christina to her word and I have downsized it to a six by eight entry into my December um, album, my, my December documented, I guess, for this year for want of a better word. So I used just some white cardstock and I'm playing with the Coco Vanilla Merry and Bright collection, the new Christmas collection. I didn't get all the collection. I got the six by eight uh, papers and I got the ephemera and I got the flare. I think those were the only three items that I got. And I've paired that with a few of my fun and lovely new <laughs> little addiction, Nicole Jones 911 DigiPrints. So this photo is just a silly photo. Um, I really want, I wanted a Christmas mask. I, I figured, I mean, if we, we have to do this, I, and I, of course, as you know, when I work, I work with the public. So I wanted a Christmas mask. So last weekend, I just went to the pharmacy and I actually found, I have two. I have this one with snowflakes and I have a navy one that has a little bit of a Norwegian type winter sweater pattern on it. So I did that and I sent it off to um, Christy and to Helen and I said, there you go. I'm all, I de first time I've ever decorated myself for Christmas. So I thought I would get that of course into the album and I followed Vicky's layout pretty closely so the larger rectangular piece here in the back with some strips uh here I did some banners and just did a cut here at this end just to add a little bit of interest down here at the bottom I did um a little bit of mixed media on the background like Vicky did I extended mine out maybe a little bit more but in the end I've covered it I've pretty much covered it all up, but I used my colorings in Oh Say Can You See, which as you know, is one of my favorite sort of minty aqua -y greens. I used the Heidi Swap Color Shine in Peach, which is another one of my favorite colors because it, it sort of goes a little bit more towards a corally color. And then I dug out my lovely and trusted old Glimmer Mist in coffee shop which is really more of a copper a nice bright copper color so i got that done on my background then i inked my edges here in um brown india and i think it's a stampin up pick and i think it was baked brown sugar because it, it was very close to this cocoa vanilla wood grain you know i love my wood grains I matted my photo. I double matted my photo in a very narrow mat and a little bit of a wider mat as is what I've been doing lately uh, based on a technique that I stole, I borrowed from Sarah Scraps. And therefore I got my photo down. And then instead of having a tag with some twine here, I just put um, a tab, 
Uh, then I went into the ephemera from the Coco Vanilla collection, and I actually fussy cut this out from a journaling card, popped it up on foam, then put one of my little cameras here to sort of have a nice little area in this corner. Now, I did my squares here. Vicky did hers, I think, at two by two. I did my squares at one by one, so mine did not go quite to the bottom as hers do but I felt that one and a quarter inch squares would be a little bit too big as it would probably go right right over to the side so I did the one by one and I decided to just put this Marion Bright that I also cut down from a little bit of the cut apart sheet uh, six by eight cut apart sheet mounted this up on foam and then to finish off this little triangle I used the ephemera the holly berries and a leaf here in the back so I quite like um I quite like how that looks and I just popped up here just so that I would have my top and my little corner filled you know I haven't talked about that in a while but I still still need to do it so I just put fun and a little enamel dot and my title um I used some pink fresh studio little tiny puffy stickers trim all things now my first title was that I really wanted because which is what I did is decorated myself for Christmas but it really didn't fit here and then just decorated myself it it really just took up too much space uh this way so I really didn't like it and then I thought of trim all the things because I have my tree here in the back trim so I figured that would work you know I trim myself and trim the tree but then it extended beyond the bottom here. So in the end, I mean, I think we get the idea of what I'm doing here. So trim all things is what the title is. Popped up this little floral from the Coco Vanilla collection and put in some a little enamel dots in areas just to add a little bit more interest. And these two acrylic squares, which come from the Scrapbook and Cards Today December sampler kit. So there you go. There you go, Christina. Vicky, I was honored, honored to scrap lift you. You know I love your style, and I've actually got another one of your layouts on my desk to do the same kind of thing with, so hopefully I will have that up in the next few days before Christmas, or at least in between Christmas and New Year's. And please make sure you pop on down below and follow the link to Karina's Instagram to see the gorgeous layout that she did. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, I think was it the Grap 5 that she did? I know she did a challenge from the party. So pop on down below and see that. And I will see you back here very, very soon. Thanks for being here. Have a wonderful day and stay safe. Bye for now, friends.